Okay, so I've been pondering this idea of letting go, recognizing its sophistication under various conditions. Now, what if letting go goes beyond the outcome, as we discussed in a previous episode? There's always more to discover because when you think you know, you don't know. But that in return illustrates the evolution of growth. On the spiritual journey, it's crucial to release what not only the outcome is, but the people and or situations, obviously. Once that is done, the next step of allowing your mind to shift and adapt to the new reality you've created. Now I've shared the analogy of the elevator journey to the top, but here's a much deeper one, much, much deeper one. When I'm truly ready to shed an old version of myself, I enter into a meditation state with frequency music. I visualize myself standing on a cliff overlooking the ocean facing the old version of myself. So we have old and we have new. Any guesses of who's getting thrown off the cliff? Anyways, without fail, I express gratitude to the old version of myself for the journey. I hand off any bad habits. I have a brief conversation, better known as the coming to Jesus. And then there she goes. But before she goes, the old version always will say to me through this meditation, I might be going, but I'll see you soon. Symbolizing that growth never stops. While one version dives off the cliff, a newer, enlightened version walks away with confidence and knowledge. Now the key to all this lies in forgiveness, because before she departs, you have to give forgiveness of what you did allow and what you didn't know any better about. Because you see, in each chapter of our lives, we tend to pick up toxic people and habits and so on, which are all lessons that we need to learn on our individual soul journey. Expressing gratitude, forgiveness, and the acknowledgement of, I'll see you soon, summarizes this process. As we step into a new year right now, consider letting go of what no longer is serving you, allowing it to cascade off the cliff of your mind. It's perfectly acceptable to bring a bus <laughs> to the cliff, unloading a lifetime of burdens, because it's better to release than to carry the weight that no longer or doesn't even belong to you. I now look forward to the cliff because it means a wave of change is here and it's time to evolve. I hope this week's episode has helped you and thank you for watching. For anyone looking to collaborate, please send me a message. I would love to hear from you. That information can be found in the link below. And until we meet next time, remember to always stay glamorous.